News Channel 5 starts now. It's kind of our lifeline. We need to have breathing air. A lifeline cut, and first responders worry they won't have clean air to breathe. All new at 6, News Channel 5 is exposing a serious safety issue involving Cleveland's firefighters. We've uncovered broken city equipment that has firefighters relying on other departments to fill their air tanks. Now only on 5, Derek Waller is getting results from city officials. Well, Danita, you know this is raising serious concerns about our emergency preparedness ahead of the Republican National Convention uh, later this summer. Now, speaking only to News Channel 5 today, the fire chief tells me that some broken equipment will now be fixed after I started asking questions. We rely on our masks on a daily basis. You know, we're fighting fires every day. We need to have an ample and quality supply of breathing air. That's why Union President Tim Corcoran is ringing the alarm about broken air compressors used to fill these tanks. All five of them, like this unit at the department's main storage facility downtown, don't work, and the city's known about it since last week. It's kind of our lifeline. We need to have breathing air. And look at what they're doing instead, driving this Cleveland air tanker down to Valley View for a fill-up. We shot this video today. Corcoran tells me this happens every day, relying on a smaller department to supply Cleveland with critical safety infrastructure. A city this size needs to be able to produce its own breathing air. I went to the chief's office to find out why contractors haven't been called in to make repairs. Is this an issue of, of um, not paying the bill? No, that's not the issue. Instead, Chief Angelo Calvillo tells me those compressors were under major stress from a department with about 30 stations and 750 firefighters. We are looking into it and we will get it handled. How quickly? Uh, we're looking in the next couple of days that we're going to get a technician out there and, and take a look at that main compressor. And he is talking about that main compressor that's located at Fire Station 28 over on Carnegie Avenue downtown. But that means that four of the five still won't be working even after those repairs. Now, he also says that the city has a backup system of 11 tanks located at departments across the city. He says this is an issue, but he stresses it is not a critical one. Live in Cleveland, Derek Waller, News Channel 5.